The 49th United States Congress was a meeting of the legislative branch of the United States federal government, consisting of the United States Senate and the United States House of Representatives. It met in Washington, D.C. from March 4, 1885, to March 4, 1887, during the first two years of Grover Cleveland's first presidency. The apportionment of seats in the House of Representatives was based on the Tenth Census of the United States in 1880. The Senate had a Republican majority, and the House had a Democratic majority. <laughs> Major events March 4, 1885, Grover Cleveland became President of the United States November 25, 1885, Vice President Thomas A. Hendricks died. Major legislation January 19, 1886, Presidential Succession Act of 1886, ch. 4, 24 Stat. 1 February 3, 1887, Electoral Count Act, ch. 90, 24 Stat. 373 February 4, 1887, Interstate Commerce Act, ch. 104, 24 Stat. 379 February 8, 1887, Indian General Allotment Act, Dawes Act, ch. 119, 24 Stat. 388 March 2, 1887, Agricultural Experiment Stations Act of 1887 March 2, 1887, Hatch Act of 1887, ch. 314, 24 Stat. 440 March 3, 1887, Tucker Act, ch. 359, 24 Stat. 505 March 3, 1887, Edmonds Tucker Act, ch. 397 24 stat 635 topic party summary the count below identifies party affiliations at the beginning of the first session of this congress and includes members from vacancies and newly admitted states when they were first seated changes resulting from subsequent replacements are shown below in the changes in membership Section Topic Senate Topic House of Representatives Democratic one hundred eighty two Majority Republican one hundred forty one National Greenback one Independent Democratic, 1 TOTAL members, 325. Leadership Senate President, Thomas A. Hendricks D, until November 25, 1885, vacant thereafter, President pro tempore, John Sherman R. December 7, 1885 to February 26, 1887. John J. Ingalls R. from February 26, 1887. Republican Conference Chairman, George F. Edmonds. Democratic Caucus Chairman, James B. Beck. Democratic Campaign Committee Chairman, Arthur Pugh Gorman. Topic. House of Representatives Speaker, John G. Carlyle D. Democratic Caucus Chairman, John Randolph Tucker Republican Conference Chair, Joseph Gurney Cannon Members Senate Senators were elected by the state legislatures every two years, with one-third beginning new six-year terms with each Congress. Preceding the names in the list below are Senate class numbers, which indicate the cycle of their election. 
In this Congress, Class I meant their term ended with this Congress, requiring re election in 1886, Class II meant their term began in the last Congress, requiring re election in 1888, and Class III meant their term began in this Congress, requiring re election in 1890. <laughs> House of Representatives The names of members of the House of Representatives are listed by district. <laughs> Changes in membership The count below reflects changes from the beginning of the first session of this Congress. <laughs> Senate Replacements, 7 Democratic, 1 seat net gain Republican, 1 seat net loss Liberal Republican, 1 seat net loss Deaths, 3 Resignations, 6 Interim appointments, 1 Total seats with changes, 9 <laughs> House of Representatives Replacements, 11 Democratic, 2-seat net gain Republican, 2-seat net loss Deaths, 8 Resignations, 7 Contested election, 1 Total seats with changes, 16 Committees <laughs> 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 Lists of committees and their party leaders, for members House and Senate of the committees and their assignments, go into the official congressional directory at the bottom of the article and click on the link five links in the directory after the pages of Terms of Service, you will see the committees of the Senate, House standing with subcommittees, select and special and joint and after the committee pages, you will see the House, Senate committee assignments in the directory, on the committees section of the House and Senate in the official congressional directory, the committee's members on the first row on the left side shows the chairman of the committee and on the right side shows the ranking member of the committee. <inaudible> Senate Additional accommodations for the Library of Congress select Agriculture and Forestry Appropriations Audit and control the contingent expenses of the Senate Civil Service and Retrenchment Claims Coast defenses Commerce Compensation of members of Congress select. Distributing public revenue among the states select. District of Columbia Education and labor Engrossed bills Enrolled bills Epidemic diseases select. Examine the several branches in the civil service Executive department's methods select. Expenditures of public money Finance Fisheries Foreign relations Indian affairs Indian traders select. Interstate commerce select. Judiciary Library Manufactures Military affairs Mines and mining Mississippi River and its tributaries select. Naval affairs Nicaraguan claims select. Ordnance and war ships select. Patents, pensions, post office and post roads, Potomac River front select. Printing, private land claims, privileges and elections, public buildings and grounds, public lands, railroads, revision of the laws, revolutionary claims, rules. Tariff regulation select Tenth Census select Territories Transportation routes to the seaboard Whole Woman suffrage select Topic House of Representatives Accounts Admission to the floor select Agriculture Alcoholic liquor traffic select American Ship Building Select Appropriations Banking and Currency Claims 
Coinage, weights and measures Commerce District of Columbia Education Elections Enrolled bills Expenditures in the Interior Department Expenditures in the Justice Department Expenditures in the Navy Department Expenditures in the Post Office Department Expenditures in the State Department Expenditures in the Treasury Department Expenditures in the War Department Expenditures on Public Buildings Foreign Affairs Indian Affairs Invalid Pensions Labor Levies and Improvements of the Mississippi River Manufactures Mileage Military Affairs Militia Mines and Mining Naval Affairs Pacific Railroads Patents Pensions Post Office and Post Roads Public Buildings and Grounds Public Lands Railways and Canals Revision of Laws Rivers and Harbors Rules Standards of Official Conduct Territories War Claims Ways and Means Whole Topic. Joint Committees Conditions of Indian Tribes Special Scientific Bureaus Topic. Caucuses Democratic House Democratic Senate Topic Employees Architect of the Capitol, Edward Clark Librarian of Congress, Ainsworth Rand Spofford Public Printer of the United States, Sterling P. Rounds until 1886, Thomas E. Benedict starting 1886 <inaudible> Senate Secretary of the Senate, Anson G. McCook Sergeant-at-Arms, William P. Kanati Chaplain Elias D. Huntley, Methodist, elected December 18, 1883 John G. Butler, Lutheran, elected March 15, 1886. <laughs> House of Representatives Chaplain, William H. Milburn, Methodist. Doorkeeper, Samuel Donelson. Clerk, John B. Clark, Jr. Clerk at the Speaker's Table, Nathaniel T. Crutchfield. Postmaster, Lycurgus Dalton. Reading Clerks, Data Unknown, Missing Sergeant at Arms, John P. Leadham See also United States elections, 1884 elections leading to this Congress United States presidential election, 1884 United States Senate elections, 1884 United States House of Representatives elections, 1884 United States elections, 1886 elections during this Congress, leading to the next Congress United States Senate elections, 1886 United States House of Representatives elections, 1886